It's about time you stopped staring into space. I play this. The spell card fake hero. Now I can summon a new monster as long as it's got elemental hero in its name. Like elemental hero Neo. Shazam. Jaden just brought out the big guns. Hey Sarge, what are you waiting for? Open up a can of Neos on this guy. Um, you do realize he can't attack don't you? He needs to wait until his next turn. Ah, I knew that. Excuse me. Still down here. Maybe I can't attack, but I can. Do this. Neos, Scarab, combine to create, Elemental Hero Flaneos. Count up your spells and traps. Cause each one, gives Flaneos 400 extra points. Is he predictable or what? Now that Axel's graveyard is out of fire monsters, his firewall can't stop me. Flaneos, direct attack. I don't think so. I activate. Burial from a different dimension. It lets me take three monsters that are out of play and add them to my grave. Then just like before, I remove my volcanic shell from play, and activate firewall. And I'm sending in my avian again. Deja vu. If you're gonna repeat the same moves, then so will I. Time to break this cycle. Huh? With this. My contact out. Say what? It's about time one of us tried something original, right? I was getting bored. Now I can unfuse Flaneos. And since Neos and Flare Scarab are in my deck, now I can summon them. Huh? I'm beginning to understand why Viper's so interested in this kid. Flaneos. Separate. Neos, attack. Cosmic Crush. I remove my Flame Emperor from my graveyard, to activate Firewall. Flare Scarab, time to pick up where Neos left off. No. I'm afraid it's true. And don't forget for every spell and trap card you have in play, Scarab gets 400 more attack points. Ugh. 